Hey, yo, what up? This is Dirty. Um, planning on doing some videos outside. I was gonna try to maybe dirt coat that uh, Gerber sphere, but um, it's fucking raining like a motherfucker over here. So, uh, do another little video. Um, this is by request of that asshole nuts are fancy. Keeps asking me to make him fucking Mexican food, make some kind of Mexican food. I told you, asshole, I'm not Mexican. <laughs> But anyways, I'll show you how to cook some other, maybe some Hawaiian dishes. So we'll go check them out. Shoot. Hey, yo, what up? Uh, since it's raining outside today, we're going to do something inside. Do a little um, cooking with Dirty and the family. We got OD808 over here helping out. Doing a little tactical food preparation, if you will. So, today we're going to make an um, lao lao. Some pork butt with black cod. It's gonna be steamed. Real simple. Um, but you might have a hard time finding some of these ingredients, honestly, where you live. So, they're like little, three of them, little pouches wrapped up right here. So, what you do is you start off with these are taro leaves. Might be kind of hard to find where you live. Um, but hey, you, I mean, you never know. You might have them. So, if you do, you start off with a couple of them, make a little Nice little bed. Put um, we got pork butt here. Nice good amount of fat on it because you want it to be nice and flavorful. Little chunk of black cod, and the uh, green stuff in there is the stems of these taro leaves. Yeah, kind of cut out adds a little more moisture. Then after that, you wrap it up in a nice little mini burrito, if you will. <laughs> Again, I'm not Mexican though. But I know like, that's how you guys relate it, so you know it's easy for you guys. So after you make a bunch of them, seen earlier, he's wrapping it up. You make a nice little little present. This is um, tea leaves. This outside wrapper you don't eat. It's kind of more like the cooking shell, and it gives a nice uh, aroma to the to the to the um, lao lao too. Some people cook it in like tin foil, I guess. But this is the better way to do it. So the pork butt is just salted with Hawaiian salt, garlic salt. Um, this is what it's just cooked Marinated. up. Yeah, this is hard boiled. This is this boiled. Is just boiled. Yeah. And then this is the black cod or the butterfish, um, just salted Hawaiian salt. If you don't boil that, uh, why do you wrap it? That would kick out. So if you don't boil it, it'll. It'll pop, yeah. poke out of the little casing that you make for it. Okay. So after you have three of these little little pouches made, you wrap it one way with the tea leaf, then you get it, turn it, and then wrap it the other way with it. Yeah. Wrap the three inside. Yeah. That's it. Then after that, you gotta make this string tying apparatus, which is required for this. <clears throat> of course, homemade by my gramps over here. That's how we do it around here. We don't buy things, we make it with leftover stuff around the house. Right. It's called, we, we're, we're into saving the earth around here. Reuse, recycle. So you tie a nice little, nice little present, and then you throw it in a big pot. We're gonna use, this gonna be a steamer. We're gonna steam it for about four hours. And it'll be ready to eat. If you've ever had la la before, I'm pretty sure it's real fatty. There's probably a big ass chunk of fat in there. So we don't do that around here. I mean, we use a you know a good amount, so it gives it flavor, but not so much that that's all you get. And if you've ever had one of our lao laos, you'll never want to eat another one again because they're the best. So yeah, real simple. I mean, besides trying to find the ingredients, I mean, pork butt. I'm sure is red readily available where you are. Black cod, uh, I don't know how available that is. But, and also the taro leaves. <laughs> but hey, if you have them around you, maybe you can make this also. Something we serve with this is of course, this is gonna be like, almost like Hawaiian salsa. It's called lomi salmon. It's a nice salty, um, real oniony kind of flavor. What is it, what it is, it's salted salmon. You got um, sweet onions, tomatoes, green onions. 
And then, what else? Do you guys salt, put salt or anything? No. Yeah, and that's it. But you, it's, it smells almost like a salsa. You can barely, the, the, you don't even taste any of this, the fish, pretty much. You can see all those little pink things, that's the fish. So, if you ever go to like a luau and you gotta eat poi, and you don't like the poi, throw this stuff inside it, and it makes it taste a lot better. <laughs> That's what I do, cause over here I'm like the white boy, you know. I'm like the white Mexican guy, so I, I always gotta, you know, they make me potatoes and stuff when everyone else is eating rice. But yeah, anyways, just thought I'd show you guys some uh, Hawaiian food on this rainy day. Some lao lao, some lomi lomi salmon. All right, this cooking with dirty and the fams again. Shoots. Four hours later. Yeah. Take this uh, Ready to eat. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know what's out of our way. So, like I said before, you just discard this outer layer. That's more like the cooking package. And then inside you got those three little perfect meat pouches of goodness. Alright, so here we go. See that nice pork. Got that uh, little piece of that black cod, the butterfish. And then this was all the leaf, the taro leaf. Then see, this is the little stems I was yeah, inside. Yeah, one. Try it. Take a little taste here. Oh yeah. God. How is it? Good? Oh, super good. Perfect. Oh yeah. Okay. <laughs> there you go. Some lao lao. Good stuff. So if you want to try to make it where you are, you can maybe replace the taro with spinach leaf. And uh, what, what could you wrap it with? Tinfoil. Yeah, tinfoil. You can wrap it with tinfoil, throw them in your oven. Yeah. You can. So, it's a lao lao. I'm going to finish this yeah. right here. But, um, this is dirty. Shoots. <laughs>